winner of the 2023 World Athlete of the Year for track event is Noah Lyles. Noah Lyles is a superstar on and off the track, and I'm extremely happy to see him receive this recognition. What is even more exciting is that this is only the beginning of Noah's journey towards many, many more successes. Lyles needs to stay relaxed here, but he's pulling away. It's a slingshot around the bend. Hughes running well in the middle. Knighton's trying to go with him. Watch the clock. It's gold again. The greatest showman delivers a blockbuster finish in Budapest. Was there ever any doubt? He promised three. He's delivered three. Noah Lyles has put sprinting front and centre on the global stage. Probably started the fire for 2023, not getting it in 2022. I remember when Mondo got his last year, and I leaned over to my mom and I said, they're really gonna make me win this 100. And I went back to my coach and said, all right, let's go to work.世界田联在总部摩纳哥举行颁奖盛典。今年的世界田径最佳男女运动员奖不再像过去颁发给男女各一名运动员，而是根据项目选出了六位最佳人选。相信这也是世界田联首次遭遇如此的幸福烦恼
。仅仅过了七天，吉普耶根在钻石联赛巴黎站女子五千米比赛以十四分零五秒二零夺冠，又刷新了埃塞俄比亚选手吉迪保持了近三年的世界纪录，提升幅度达到了一秒四二。七月二十二号凌晨，吉普耶根在钻石联赛摩纳哥站又在女子一英里项目以四分零七秒六四夺冠，并将原世界纪录缩短了四秒六九。在四十九天内，吉普耶根上演了三次打破三个项目世界纪录的奇迹。男子路跑项目最佳运动员为肯尼亚人吉普图姆，他在今年十月芝加哥马拉松赛上跑出两小时零五分三十五秒，把肯尼迪名将。基普乔格在2020年柏林马拉松上创造的两小时零一分九秒的记录提高了三十四秒，成为了历史上第一位在正式比赛中跑进两小时零一分的马拉松运动员。女子路跑项目最佳运动员为埃塞俄比亚跑者阿塞法，她在今年九月柏林马拉松赛上以两小时十一分五十二秒的成绩夺冠，将科斯盖此前在芝加哥马拉松赛上创造的世界纪录提高了两分十二秒。